you're a first time visitor, welcome. And I hope you like, subscribe, especially subscribe. Very important uh, that you do that with something so new or, you know what I mean. So today I'm going to talk about this book. <clears throat> so we're going to open it up, give you a good look at it. Maybe give it a little bit of a run through, read through. Um, it's a pretty new book. Star Trek, the motion picture inside the art and visual effects. I want to tell you and show you if there's anything new in it. Uh, you know, there's a lot of stuff out there with the, uh, if you're a Star Trek fan, you've seen a lot of it. Is there anything new in here that maybe you've never seen before, never seen before stuff? It also gives you a good look. I'm hoping it gives you a good look on making movies. So let's open this baby up. Take the old exacto. You know, if you go to the store, and if you go and buy this on Amazon, you don't get a really good feel of what's going on. And bookstores, it's wrapped up like this too. Really cool sh things there. Lots of cool Ralph McQuarrie stuff. Interesting stuff about how they started assembling and how things were going wrong with certain teams. Robert Probert. Really neat, couple neat shots there that I've never seen before. Early computer stuff. There's the extra. You know, talking about uh, Douglas Trumbull. Really nice photograph, big, big picture. I've seen that one online, I believe, before. Great, great picture of the Enterprise here. There's some stuff here. Wish there was a couple bigger pictures there, but it gives you really good information on working. I mean, this, this is, I've never seen those before. And this, I've never seen that before inside. If you're a model maker, I mean, that's cool stuff. A couple pictures I've never seen before there. A Robert Probert, I believe, uh, map painting. I could be wrong about that. Neat behind the scenes. A couple of them I've never seen before. A top painting I've never seen before. stuff there nice shot of that space station two neat things there I love this you know the dental mirrors that they use to do the lighting on the Enterprise Neat stuff there. Really nice shuttle pictures. A 
The V'ger stuff, there's a real lot of concept stuff here. So they didn't know what they were going to do. And that's, you know, well, we, what's this thing going to look like? Nice little storyboards itself. I've never seen that picture, that painting before. This, this stuff is pretty new to me. That's pretty darn neat. That's a lot of new stuff here, as far as I know. Uh, it's pretty neat showing you how they did that whole scene. <clears throat> And the quality of the paper of this book is really nice. And uh, I mean, everything is very, very clear on here. It's a really well done book, put together book. And the Klingon ship pictures, I wish that was a bigger picture, but uh, there is some really cool stuff of the Klingon ship in here. The Takinga class. I can never say that right. That's what it turned into, I believe, for undiscovered country. I could be wrong. I haven't read this part, but there's some great pictures of the ship in here. And when you're reading the beginning of the book, you, you're like, oh, is that going to be in here? And yeah, it's in there. Really nice storyboard stuff. This is one of the most seen shots of the Enterprise. It's a little like a distorted image. That's pretty, pretty darn neat. So this book is like 50 bucks. I am geeking out on it. And uh, I really think it's cool. Can't wait to give it a full read. I went through a little bit of it. But I highly recommend it. It's $50. So in conclusion, Get this book. If you, if you like making movies, if you like Star Trek, if you like art, uh, all that kind of stuff, it's a really nice looking book. Reading them, some of it gives you a really good idea of what was going on between special effects groups and how this became that and making of the movie. Uh, it's not a great movie. It's got some really cool things, but it's in the history of Star Trek, if you're a Star Trek fan, I mean, there's things to like about it. I mean, think about the uniqueness of this becoming a big motion picture with people who were from the show. I mean, most of the time it's a show that's, if it's made into a movie, it's got different actors in it and somebody has cameos, but they took the original cast and made this big budget movie and uh, it's become bigger since that time. And uh, I think, you'll enjoy this read um, and the artwork. Like I said, you're looking at it. And thanks again for watching. And uh, again, like and subscribe. And thanks.